gonna do with dirty? What are you gonna do with dirty? Punch, punch. Why are you gonna punch me? So, you guys, we just finished doing our interview. And we're about to do family exercise because they need to uh, yeah, too much some energy. Of energy. Yes, for sure. So, let's go. You ready to do our family exercise? You got a fuzzy in your hair. Look at your hair. Y'all. Look, look at the. I tell you, we need to change the rug, baby. Look. Look. When we bought this rug. Look at this, y'all. We always have fuzzies. They said it was only gonna last for six months, and we still have it. Two years. Yeah. Almost two. Your turn. So we definitely have to replace. Let's go. Let me move the table. <laughs> We're gonna do a push-up challenge, yo. Girls against boys. You ready, Jordan? We got this. All right, girls, go first. Hold on. We're gonna do ours next. Ready? Go. Let's see how many they could do. One, two, three. Ooh, good job, good job, good job, good job. Five. Good job. Six, <laughs> eight, nine, ten. Ooh. Booyah. What? All right, I'll turn. I'll turn. I'll turn. Hey, hey, hey. They got ten. <laughs> he got ten. You got drink. Who? Who? Come on. Ready? Put your hands forward. There you go. Hands forward. Both of them. There you go. One. Two. Two. Three. Four. He's not gonna win. We won. Are you kidding me? What's ten plus eleven? Ten plus eleven? Mm-hmm. 21. Whoa, that was fast. Jordan. Wait, that's not a hard one. <laughs> oh, you miss. <laughs> you miss. Ow. <laughs> I love you. Ow. Hey, baby. Ooh, wee. My baby made me a whole sandwich. Okay. Oh, look at our knives. Oh man. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. Were we trying to open up doors? I love them so much. Like they're the Dr. Mercola ones, but my dad when he, he was cut here, coconuts. I asked him to cut the coconut, and he was doing that, and yeah. Destroyed it. Destroyed it. Shout out to Papa. It's okay. It was on accident. Yeah, it was accident. But yeah, y'all. Look, we're in the middle of watching the Saints versus Cowboys. I ain't worried about nothing. It's 10 to 13 in the fourth quarter. Just started the fourth quarter. And uh, I know Cowboy fans booked up because they kept us from getting to like 40, 50 points. That's what we average. You know, who that forever. And uh, we're going to pull this one out because they keep making horrible sure, mistakes. Salmon and, um, foil, I don't see it don't matter. I just want to eat something. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to eat. So yeah, I'm going to take y'all in the game. You didn't press pause? No, it's live. No, I didn't press pause it. Pause. It was on commercial. Why you gotta talk to me like that, Wafas? Come on, Saints Day. I need you to we, press we, we go together. I know. We, we do things in unison and love. D was th starting to, you know, panic a little bit until we score. Let me go pause it. In Dallas. And so, it's 13-10. Uh, Second and 10. Cowboys got the ball. Six minutes left. In the game, y'all. So I gotta pause that joint. Woo! Big old piece of fish. Yeah. Yeah, make me a little bit with some quinoa. Oh, uh, right now? Yeah, what you talking about? It's been, um. How you been feeling? Good day. I've been feeling, you know, the same. Um, I do have an appointment in the morning, bright and early, 7 45. Uh, cause I just can't wait till the 14th. I'm getting like crazy symptoms. I feel like I've been getting hot flashes today. So that's new. My heart has been like, I don't know if it's my heart or my chest. I don't know what it is y'all. I just been getting like crazy heart palpitations. But um. This game not helping. I know. Ooh, I'm getting shivers. <laughs> but I think it's the shivers right now are just cause it's, it's getting kind of chilly in the house. But um. <clears throat> yeah. It's just 
been the same, but I have been. You've been active. Active. I want to see you at home, girl. I've been out of the bed. That's for sure. I went actually, and I had lunch with one of my friends, so that was nice. Like right when I got there, um, I got a call from our nanny and Jerry, also um, saying uh, he was complaining with his head. Like he says, my head hurts. Her. Yeah, little Jerry. And he asked for like when I got home, he asked for an ice pack. And like he was just saying that his head hurts and I was like what what do you mean like what's wrong like tell me I was like did you hit your head and you didn't tell me and he was like I think I did and he was like oh I did hit my head yesterday and um, he hit he said he hit his head like trying to get books from his bookshelf and there's it's a part of his closet and he hit like he was like I went like this and it went like that's how he explained it um, and I was like, Jerry, like, why didn't you tell me? This happened yesterday. And I was like, Jerry, why didn't you tell me? You need to tell me that. And he was like, I'm sorry, mommy. I should have told you. And like, that's what I mean. Like, we have to monitor him a lot because he's the type where he's like you. If he's in pain or he's hurting, he won't say it. Like, he won't. That's why when he was vomiting, like, the only time he would be, he would say, he wasn't feeling well would be like seconds before he was about to vomit and so yeah i was like jerry you need to tell me next time okay like and i think he's so used to when he was going to the doctor all the time the first thing he asked me he was like but if i tell you are we gonna go to the doctor like i think maybe also he doesn't want to go to the doctor obviously um because he associates that with getting poked with a needle getting his blood drawn or the popsicle stick where they open wide and swab his throat. Um, so yeah, we've been monitoring him. His eye like right here is like a little pink, but he says his eyes feel fine. How are you feeling? Good. Good, how's your head? Good right now. It's good right now? Yeah, I needed two ice packs though. You, you needed two ice packs? You still want an ice pack right now? Yeah. Are, Okay, we'll get you a nice pack. And Jordan, look it, come see. Her skin is getting dry. It's like she has really bad eczema around this time. So I've been putting like coconut oil to try and like moisturize her face. And I also use this stuff. Um, I gave her an oatmeal bath using this. It's like 100% colloidal oatmeal. And it like really dried up because her eczema flared up like on her stomach area and on her back and like by her arms. Um, she was, it was really like flared, like red and irritated. So I did that. I soaked her in oatmeal bath. And then now it's like what it is now. It's like really, really dry, which is good, which means it's getting better. So I took some of this for my bladder health and d -manos. Um, I should probably take this as well, cranberry, but I haven't taken that one today. Um, and then I always take vitamin D3 um, in hopes to feel better, but my symptoms, like I said, like I'll feel better on with certain things and then it'll go away and then I have other symptoms that show up so my body just playing games and um i'll get more information hopefully in the morning it's nine o'clock y'all okay, my throat now is starting to really hurt um i'm hoping i feel really warm i'm gonna take my temperature because the second i get a fever that's when like yeah i'm just gonna go to the er um but my body, I feel like, is really like whatever's going on. It's like fighting back, you know. I'm really, I'm proud of how today went, though. Regardless, yeah. you know, I've been having. I think the most pain I've had today is like the constant throbbing back pain in my lower back. So that's why I set another doctor's appointment in the morning because I need them to like check my. I'm gonna see if they can run blood work on my my kidneys or, and then I want them to check for see if they can check for like all autoimmune diseases if there's like a blood test for for that but <coughs> i find because i find myself just getting like i'm fighting it back you know what i mean mm -hmm. like it's weird because physically i'm getting up out of the bed i'm doing better 
with fighting it back and not staying in bed mm -hmm. and doing things throughout the day. Yeah. But as far as my symptoms and like they're getting, I feel like they're getting worse. So yeah, it's like I'll be strong the entire day and then I'll, I'll like the brunt of it is like at night usually, right? Like yes, that's the last time y'all saw me. I, I was behind that entire, yeah. And then last night I was up from like 1 a.m. to 4 a.m. Like I woke him up because I want I was gonna get some water, but I was I as soon as I sat up I felt so dizzy like my legs felt heavy, and I was just nervous to walk to the kitchen by myself like in the dark. So I how do you I'm sorry babe. Thank you. My pleasure. Anyways, we're gonna watch the rest of this game. They're gonna win. Go Saints. Yeah, and I'll catch up with you guys after. That sucked. We still win the Super Bowl. Who that? All right, kids. Daddy needs a special prayer from my angels um, because we didn't have the best game tonight, but we're still going to win the Super Bowl. And it's who that forever, so I'm going to need a special prayer from Jerry and Jordan. Okay. So let's pray. The I know. Let's go ahead. Let's do family prayer. Daddy just let's, had to let you know that I need a special prayer tonight. But Dear God, God. And mommy. thank God for mommy. Daddy. Thank God for daddy. Thank God for Jordan the big, big girl. Thank God for Jerry the big boy. Thank God for food. Thank God for water. Thank God for my bed. protecting my saints and all the saints all over the world because we're going to win the Super Bowl in Jesus' name. Amen! Amen! I can't leave my party! Your party is coming up soon, that's right. I love you guys. Thank you. Can I No, no, no! <laughs>